the firefighters and the firemen actually came and they showed the kids um, all their equipment and their tools. And then um, after they were done with that presentation, they, the firefighters actually took the kids out to see the real fire truck. And I asked them to tell me about the different parts of the fire truck. We actually used the Think Blocks in that lesson. And I had um, a piece of paper with the word fire truck on it. And um, that was where I kind of wrote down, recorded what they were saying, kind of like a shared, a shared writing. I, I was really impressed when they were going through and naming the parts of the fire truck because they were naming parts that I wouldn't necessarily, necessarily think of. They, for example, they named the part where you drive, or the cab. And so then, then they started to break that down, and they're like, inside there you need a chair to sit on, you need the thing to drive, and, which was the steering wheel, and then they said, and the, and the key. And um, then they said the ladder, and when they said the ladder, they said that you need the part that goes up, or the part to go up, because it was one of the ladder trucks that came, and it had the box where the firefighters had to go up. So when they were naming it, and when they were naming the parts, they were actually breaking the parts down into smaller parts. We've used the same box every year, but when they've been working with the fire truck, they really use the front part as the cab and the back part as the truck part, whereas in the past they've just said it's one truck, so there's been a little more delineation there. They, When they've been role-playing with, the, um, with the props, they've been able to actually call, like, mo some of them know that the the mask and the, ox they actually know the word um, oxygen tank, so... I would say vocab has definitely changed the process. We went through and documented the process, and so we wrote about what we did. And then they started drawing fire trucks on the, on in their drawings, and it's really cool to see the drawings because they had the different parts, and they were the drawings were more detailed, and they started labeling parts of the trucks. The thinking process is different, just like the type of detail they remember when they're talking about either an object or an event or basically the parts of